Hey everybody, welcome back to Tomb Raider. Today we're going to talk about politics, religion, and the meaning of life. Now we're just going to play a video game. We're just going to play Tomb Raider 2013 slash Reborn slash the new one. We're going to climb up these jagged walls here. When we last left off, we had... What is that? I don't know. When we last left off, we talked to Roth, and he was telling us about how we were going to climb these rocks, and he gave us this cool pickaxe thing. And now we're just kind of searching around here. Oh, wait, but we want to go down, I think. Yeah. We had found that... Um that area over here I believe somewhere around here we found something where was it? there was a little bridge and we couldn't get there because Lara didn't have um, the little pickaxe thing but I'm thinking it's up there so let's go up there and see where we are I also upgraded my piece, upgraded my gun, extended mag. That's always fun. It's starting to really look cool. Can't wait to get more weapons, more everything, full on arrows. Uh, go this way, Lara. Wait a minute. I want to be higher. Dun, dun. Get up there. Uh, what's that box? Is that some salvage in there? No. Where is the... I forgot how we... Oh. Settle down there, Lara. I forgot how we get over there. This way? I saw something. Yes! GPS cache. It's nothing. What is that? I can't get in there, I'm, I'm guessing. Huh. This is very strange because I was over there before. So either I'm missing it or the landscape has changed slightly. Whoa, that was weird. Get back up there. Yeah, that's very strange. Well, let's go this way. It's gotta be this way. We gotta use our pickaxe thing. Scale this thing. Move, press left, and hit jump. Ah. Okay, thanks. Alright, we made it. Now we can go to this tomb here. So it did change the landscape. So when I was having a conversation with Roth and it was going through that cutscene, it changed sort of what was happening there. Or it changed like where things were, whatever. Forced me to climb up the thing. Ugh, I hate these tombs. I'm playing the wrong game, I know. Uh, this is not good. What are you looking at over there? Stay focused! I 
I never know if something's gonna jump out at me. I guess that's the deal. Oh, a campsite. Why would you camp in here? Don't do that. Who's lighting all these fires? Uh, that's pointless. I'm just gonna lose it right here. Oh well. Tomb of the Unworthy. Okay. Sacrifice. Uh. There's no record of these kinds of rituals in ancient Yamatai. Ancient Yamatai. Was erased from the texts. Perhaps it was. We need to jump over there. Ugh. Gross. We can light these things on fire. I don't know if that helps us out at all. Huh. Let's see if it does. Oh, I don't have any fire over here. Okay. There's some fire. I don't know if this is going to help us, but we're going to try it. Ugh. Just lighting bodies on fire. Ugh. Gross. Oh god, there goes a body. It just fell out. That was a boot. Okay. That made this lighter. That's convenient. Now what? That looks like some rock we can climb, right? Right there? Huh. How about we shove this thing? There we go. Now we can jump on this rock. Ooh, I almost didn't make it. Oh man, that was close. I forgot I have to hit Q in order to jab my thing in there. Find a base camp. This may have been built in honor of her priestesses. Incredible. Let's check this baby out. Treasure, yes! Gasp of awe. Slight gasp. Nice. Tomb of the Unworthy. Complete. Mountain Village relic map found. Interesting. Is that all we have to do here? Yes. Well, that was a quick little tomb, wasn't it? That was easy. That was no problem at all. Why? Why have you stopped? Keep going. Okay. Let's get the hell out of this place. Right? I want nothing to do with this thing. Map updated to see reward locations on the map. What does that mean? What does that give us? Reward locations. What is this? Treasure map. Interesting. Not really sure what that means or what the deal is. I wish I knew how to drop down instead of jumping like an idiot. Alright, let's press on past these rocks here. What's down there? That's where the uh, wolf was. Such a good climber, Lara. Ugh! 
very nerve wracking. Oh, be cool, be cool. What? Nothing. There's no one up here. They never make it up this far. Hmm. Except me. Nah, let's wait out the storm. Got it. All right, you guys are not that far from each other. Now get inside, guys. Oh my god. I wonder if I can... Yikes. Alright, we got this guy over here. And that guy's facing us. That kind of presents a problem. This guy's facing us too. Is he leaning on the wall? Yeah, he is. Hmm. I'm wondering if I should just avoid them or if I should try to stealth kill them. Yeah, he's... Well, he's supposed to be leaning on the wall, but he's sort of glitched out. Arrow to the head. Point blank, mind you. That is no joke at all. And I got some salvage off him. And let me get some salvage off this guy. And I'm gonna read this book. I have spoken to some of the villagers on the island. I was expressly forbidden to leave the palace, but this did not stop me. My duties here are clear. I must learn the truth, but the stories I uncovered defy belief. Rumors abound of the queen's communion with the spiritual world. They say she commands the sun and the rain, that her lands are abundant by her will alone. <laughs> this is certainly nonsense. But what can be the cause of such whispers? Is this how she controls her people? By engaging their primitive superstitions? I saw absolute reverence in their eyes when they spoke of her. Yet, I also sense fear. Her people are treated with fairness taxed reasonably and are well protected by her storm god. No wonder some of them even pray to her. It's as if she were more than just a queen to them. Spreading discontent through her people may well be a harder task than I imagined. I don't really know what that is. I, I Is Sam the queen? Maybe? I don't know. She's like akin to those to that god creature or whatever. Alright, I need to go, like, over here. Come up around these two dudes. Alright, we got one of them there. They're not really in a position to stealth kill either one. Oh, really? For real? <laughs> you don't even notice your bro Seth's dead? Nice. Uh, you know what I forgot is... The, um... I can distract with my arrows. I should keep that in mind. I'll do that more often. GPS cache, nice, nice. Climb up this thing. Here's one of those fires that I do not have a torch for. Man, it is raining hard. Oh, that was close. Ah. Found something. A kind of mortar and pestle, probably used for preparing medicinal herbs. 
Herbs. Preparing herbs. Uh. These things, I don't really get what the deal is with these things. They're just like floating here in the middle of nowhere. I can't really do anything with them, it seems like. It's this weird tree looking thing. I need to find. Oh, here we go. Need to find some torch action. And I'm gonna go back and light that, um. that little statue thing. For sure. This thing right here. Okay, two of ten statues lit. That's gotta be good for something. Alright, now we need to get back to climbing up this crap. Like so. Can we shimmy up this tree? Oh look, there's something over here. This is one of those things where you need a different... Um, I think the, the bow, if you upgrade the bow enough, you can... Uh, place a, um, what am I trying to say, like an arrow with a rope attached to it. Whoa, what are you doing, Lara? Jeez. I see a GPS cache thing over here, or something. Yeah. Okay. Now what do I do? Oh, okay, I see there's some stuff over there, but I, I want to go... Well, alright, let's go this way. I was going to go down and get the additional um, salvage down there, but uh, it's not... I feel like I can get it any time if I, if I need to. Uh-oh. Uh... -oh. uh Oh man, that was epic. That was super cool. Lara, are you there? Yeah, hold on. I'm <laughs> I'm a little busy. Hey, did you find Sam? We're still on her trail. I'm going to try and send an SOS from an old radio tower up here. Any tips? Hey Lara, you're gonna need to find the communications console. It'll look like a bunch of old switchboards. Okay. I'll let you know when I find it. Uh oh. Please! You don't need to do this! Ah! Oh. Why can't I. Oh my god. Why? Oh, fuck this bow, man. It's time to get serious. Yeah. How about that bow? I guess I could not cock it back as much, but I don't know. All right, back in business here. Let's light this torch and get that salvage action here. Yeah, I wonder I, what I should do is test to see if I can take them out without going full on with the um, with bringing the bow back because it takes too long and then they move so it's also I suck so you know there's that part I've got a bad feeling about this
telling you, Reyes, it's mechanical, not an electrical problem. Now, Alex. <coughs> uh, this looks like it might be uh, an electrical problem. You think? <coughs> oh, hello. Hey. Who's this little fox, huh? Oh, he's cute, huh? <laughs> hey, it's yeah. Alicia. Alicia. It's my daughter. Oh. 14 hmm. years old. And smarter than you Ooh. Burn. Look at that guy's nerd shirt. Don't that guy shops at Think Geek. And, yeah. It's got the glasses. Probably electrical. From her father. So I was on the walk, right? Doing a spot of midnight fishing. Hey, Grim. I like that guy. I do it with you. So that guy's awesome. Did we get to meet this guy? So I'm talking about. Uh oh. Dude, this guy. Exactly. Thank you. Dr. James Whitman, filler 15, take three, action. and action. Okay, now take a firm grip, and then slice him down the belly, like this. This isn't, this isn't B-roll, by the way. <laughs> She's like, can I take B-roll? B-roll is not you talking in an interview. Is, is he coming back? <sighs> I'll go get him. All these relationships going on. It's like a soap opera. This damned reality TV business. I'm, I'm meant to be bringing. What is this? Like Whale Wars out here? Uh, no offense, Jonah. The audience demands content, Dr. Whitman. That's what I'm saying. So until we find the Lost Kingdom, we need footage like this. Come on, let's just take it. Let's from take it from the top, people. Come on. We're gonna make you look like Gordon Ramsay. Gordon Ramsay. Dr. James Whitman, filler 15, take four. Action. Okay, now take a firm grip and then slice him down the belly like that. I've studied them so much. I can see charts on the back of my eyelids. But if I'm not right about Yamatai being in the Dragon's Triangle. I remember when you found that one, your father's digs. You ran up and showed it to me dressed in your penguin pajamas. <laughs> I was five <laughs> years old. It was my first find. Yeah. You've got great instincts, girl. You just have to trust them. Mm. That's what my father used to say. Now, there was a man that ran on instinct. For better or worse. He would have been so proud of you, Lara. We're getting closer to the storm. Whatever's coming. Uh, get through it, eh? careful there, buddy. Don't get handsy. Alright. This is bizarre. Okay, Lara. Pull yourself together. Alright, the broken tunnel. Uh, let's upgrade some stuff here. Real quick. And we have no more bow upgrades. We've got really the only thing we can upgrade is our is our gun here. Rapid fire mod. Let's go ahead and grab it. And then we'll have all the upgrades. We have everything now. Well, everything we can get. Oh wait, burst fire mod. I don't have enough. Um. All right. Well, we're making it happen, are we not? Oh, we have a skill point to to get. Get back in there. Forgot about that. Should I move into Hunter? That's the question. Oh, Brawler. Oh, man. This is a completely different thing. Dodge kill. Pain tolerance. Man, I don't know what to get now. Survivalist. That's what I was going to get. This is actually 
I should probably grab this. I just want to see what's in Brawler, though. Withstand more punishment. Uh, cleverly use dirt and rocks to blind your enemies and leave them vulnerable to your attacks. Uh, that seems highly situational when I could just shoot them. I think we're going to go with this. That way we can keep our ammo caches up and we can use our gun more. Let's hook it up. Alright, cool. Next time we will be checking out this area. I already forgot what it's called. We're going to venture in here and um, see if we can't find some awesome stuff. Here's some awesome stuff right here. Look at that. This coin probably oh, found its way into Japanese circulation sometime in the mid 19th century. Interesting. Alright, I will see you guys tomorrow.